Hi, how are, how are you both doing? Pretty good, thank you. <laughs> doing very well, thank you very much. Good, that's good. And what are your names? Uh, I'm Dave Hansen. Corey Rutledge. And what film were you a part of? Uh, Eden. And uh, what were your roles in the film? I was a writer-producer. And director-producer. Great, and could you tell us a bit about what the film was about? No, no, no. no you get to go. He's the writer. I took your idea and put it on screen. You do it. All right. It's uh, uh, about a woman who uh, is ill, who passes away, uh, and is transported to a very strange and mysterious afterlife. Mm -hmm. Oh. Sorry. Um, so, a lot of sci fi elements, I guess. Um, I would say science, more, a little science, I, say, I guess. Yeah. More science. I would say it's more mysticism. And uh, fantasy, there's a little fantasy, fantasy and drama, a little drama, horror, a little scariness, thrilling. All right, I, I've ran out of adjectives. Any more adjectives? Should we go on to adverbs? Sure. Oh god. Uh, uh, oh. S, uh, uh, fieldish. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and what was your um, inspiration for this film? Was it anything personal or just um, a story you came up with? I. When writing it, I was thinking of the idea of uh, just looking at something from a different perspective. Mm -hmm. So taking a, a, a trope or a genre that we know very well and saying, what if we flip it in some way and see what it's like, imagine what it's like from the other side. And I put that on camera. <laughs> <laughs> so you did nothing then? Yeah, I said roll and we'll figure it out after. Yep. Um, and, and are you um, like a, you work together uh, typically? Are you part of the same? We used uh, to live together. Coincidentally enough, we used to live together. Uh, we used to be roommates for a br roommates. for a, for a brief moment of time. Yeah. But we yeah, we have worked together for many years. We are uh, in part of a, a sketch comedy group. There's, so everybody in the film um, is more or less part of that group. So we sourced our sort of ensemble of friends that we work with all the time to do. Mm -hmm. Uh, the work and you if you see the film you'll notice that the acting is spectacular because we have very talented friends who make us look good so is there any um, comedic elements to this since you have your sketch None whatsoever it's absolutely dramatic and horrifying there's nothing funny about this movie yeah. left right or center I think behind the scenes was very funny and uh, yeah outside of that he nailed it yes <laughs> are there any bloopers we can see wow. none uh, none because none, they don't give away the, the, the premise. Well, no, right, I, can say, I can say this. The, the funny part about it was we decided to make a film set in a hospital right before the pandemic happened. So, so this has been four or five years in the making. So yeah. that was kind of funny in itself. Uh, small things. The, uh, the, the, the head nurse in the film yeah. uh, is his sister. <laughs> that, not not an actor. Not an actor or receptionist. Or receptionist. So sorry, receptionist. She, she came in and she was helping produce. Executive produce. She wanted to throw in. And then I said, I need more bodies. And she jumped in. So she's the first person credited. The, the young girl <laughs> yeah, yeah. in the story, uh, briefly in it, is his niece, yep. who he made audition for the part no easy three roles. times. No three easy times. Roles. Listen, callbacks and second callbacks. You want to talk did. about what this film is about? It's about there's no easy roles. No one's just getting thrown on film. You need to earn it. That's what we did. So I auditioned the shit out of her. And uh, sorry, I, s I swore. But then she got the role, so congrats to Lee. Yeah, good. Right. There was nobody else auditioning, but he did make her go through Can that we process. Swear? Where's this going? Shit. PBS Kids. Oh, oh really? no! No! <laughs> no. Oh, I'm, I'm kidding. Sorry, I'm so kidding. Sorry. Anyway, um, is there any um, final words or things you wanted to share about the film or anything at all? Um, I hope uh, when we get done with whatever festival circuit, we'll put it online. Everybody can follow. Uh, follow. Find Bristol Pomeroy, Elisa Ravinsky, Dave Hansen, great writer, Sharif Mockbell, the DP, and I'll be directing some other things uh, online and around, so I'm looking forward to working on more things. What he said. What he said. <laughs> Thank you so much.